Hey guys, it's Melanie. So as stated in the description of this video, um, there is a warning. So I am apologizing in advance for, for any ugly crying or cussing or judgment that you may think I'm passing in this video. But I want to get my point across. And by getting my point across, I'm going to tell my story. And if it reaches just one person and makes one person change their life, then I have done my freaking job. So let me preface this a little bit. If you haven't seen my post from earlier, if you haven't been following me all week, you know that I have a family history of heart disease and cancer and all kinds of just stupid crap. I went to the ER on Sunday for some slight chest pains. Everything came out fine. But in light of that, I have been doing lives about that. I've gotten messages from people thanking me for opening their eyes up. If you saw my post, I got a message from a friend who had a friend who was having these issues and she said, because of my video, she made her friend go to the hospital. If I can just help one person, right? So, here's my story. First of all, I wanna start with asking a question and I know the answer for a lot of my friends and it's an unfortunate answer and I'm fortunate not to have this answer. The same answer as them. I told you it could get ugly. How many of you have suffered the loss of a parent at a young age? You being a young age or them being a young age. And by young age, I worked in a nursing home. By young age, I mean 70 or under as your parent. How many of you have lost them to an illness? How many of you have lost them to an illness that could have possibly been prevented? Kind of makes you think, doesn't it? Let me get to my story. I did not, I was fortunate enough not to have lost my parents. But I've had two incidents in my life that I can remember to this day. See, my mom was 59, done, that's, I'm sorry. Um, that I remember exactly how I felt when that thought went through my mind that I could lose my parents. My dad had a heart attack when he was 41 years old. I remember exactly how I felt when my sister sick came into work to tell me. I remember the exact feeling. I remember exactly what happened after that. And I remember going up to the hospital and seeing my dad there. He was still in a regular room, but I remember leaving and from the time I left and went home, he was put into ICU because he was still having chest pains and they couldn't stop them. Everything worked out okay. Um, he had two blocked arteries at the age of 41. Who thinks at the age of 41 that they're gonna have a heart attack? Not Superman. Superman can't have a heart attack, right? Um, since then, he has changed quite a few things. But another incident happened 18, 19 years later. Um, and I got that same feeling again with my mom. My mom was a smoker, my dad was too, up until he had the heart attack and there was this life-changing moment and he quit. Um, my mom had a scare with lung cancer. She had, a, she, was, she had a real bad cough for a while and you know the antibiotics and things weren't working and you know they did chest x-rays and all these kind of things and there's a spot on her lung. Well, she's a smoker, so they wanna dig deeper, they wanna dig deeper, they wanna find out what's going on, they wanna do um, a lung biopsy and all these things. And 